China tested a new missile, escalating tensions to new heights with the West, and particularly the US. The launch involved a nuclear-capable missile carrying a hypersonic glide that travels faster than the speed of sound, a technology that neither the US nor Russia possess. It featured a complex mechanism which enabled the missile to be fired mid-flight as it was traveling at least five times the speed of sound, which came as a shock to the world, revealing China's new nuclear capabilities as one that is more advanced than anyone had thought. However, mystery still looms around the details of the launch, raising red flags among experts and Western intelligence. While some believe that China in fact deployed a projectile at hypersonic speeds while carrying the warhead, others are claiming it as just some sort of countermeasure over the South China Sea, one that serves as a distraction to protect the main missile. According to the Financial Times, Beijing's launch is thought to have taken place in July, where it then flew into space and completed a partial orbit of the Earth before it descended towards the South China Sea, missing its target by a few kilometers. Beijing denied that it was a missile test and said that it was testing a reusable spacecraft instead. But the US chief of staff insisted that China was putting its advanced nuclear capabilities to the test while hoping to keep it confidential. The US chief of staff then went on to draw parallels to the Soviet Union's surprise launch in 1957 of its first satellite, Sputnik, which then triggered the space race between the world's superpowers.